Forecasters expect the system now known as potential Tropical Cyclone 9 to become Tropical Storm Isaiah's today. The system remained a trough of low pressure with a weak center of circulation as of the National Hurricane Center's 5 a.m. advisory, but forecasters expect Isaiah's to form today. The advisory shifted the storm's track slightly to the west, skirting the Gulf Coast and reaching the Tampa Bay region on Sunday night. But forecasters continue to stress that there is a high degree of uncertainty surrounding the current forecast, storm track and intensity, whether it still stay a tropical storm or gain hurricane strength, because a true center has yet to form. The entire Florida peninsula remains under the cone of uncertainty. The system was moving at 23 miles per hour and had maximum sustained winds of 45 miles per hour. It's forecast to continue in a general west-northwest direction just south of the Leeward Islands today, and near or over the Greater Antilles on Thursday. Forecasters say the system will produce heavy rains and potentially life-threatening flash flooding and mudslides across the northern Leeward Islands, the Virgin Islands in Puerto Rico and the Dominican Republic. Tropical storm warnings were in effect for these areas. Tropical storm watch is in effect for the southeastern Bahamas, the Turks and Caicos Islands and portions of the Dominican Republic and Haiti. The cyclone would likely take some time to recover after moving over the high mountains of Hispaniola, and it's possible that wind shear over the Straits of Florida could limit the storm's intensification, forecasters say. Simply put, there are a lot of hurdles in the system's way, so it is best to stay on the conservative side at the moment and continue to stress the large uncertainty after it leaves the Caribbean, the Hurricane Center advisory says. Potential Tropical Cyclone 9, Tropical Storm Isaiah's is a reminder that we are in the midst of a hyper-active Atlantic hurricane season and the peak is approaching. It's never too late to get ready for this or any other storm that will actually threaten the Bay Area. Times staff writer Josh Fialo contributed to this report. 2020 Tampa Bay Times Hurricane Guide Hurricane Season is here. Get ready and stay informed at tampabay.com slash hurricane prepare your stuff. Get your documents and your data ready for a storm build your kit. The stuff you'll need to stay safe and comfortable for the storm protect your pets. Your pets can't get ready for a storm. That's your job need to know. Click here to find your evacuation zone and shelter what Michael in 2019 taught the Panhandle and Tampa Bay what the Panhandle's top emergency officials learned from Michael were not going to give up. What a school superintendent learned from Michael what Tampa Bay school leaders fear most from a storm Tampa Bay's top cops fear for those who stay behind.